what's up guys, Dominic Muggy here and today I'm bringing you an awesome new video on Battlefield 4. I've kind of merged Black Ops 2 and Battlefield 4 together, which, uh, you know, probably should have been done, but I have done it anyway, so regardless. Today I'm bringing you a favorited class from Black Ops 2 on into Battlefield 4, so let's get straight into it. So today's sort of setup, because I think I'm thinking of making this a series, is the AN-94 with the FN-57, the AN-94 being an assault rifle that you get in the assault class. It's uh, really good, its max damage is 24.5, which is pretty decent, and then its minimum damage is 18. Its fire rate is 600 RPM in fully auto, but in burst it's 1200 RPM, which is significantly better, but I still prefer to run it in fully auto instead of burst, just for my sake. Uh, its muzzle velocity in this type of setup is 620 meters per second, and its bullet drop is 15 meters per second squared. Its mag size is 31, meaning that it's got a pretty decent mag capacity. So, you know, pretty much uh, like any other assault rifle, to be fair, in some of those aspects. But yeah, its reload speed, uh, its reload on an empty magazine is 3.5 seconds, and its reload uh, with uh, at least one round left in the mag is 2.4 seconds. Personally, I usually have a couple of rounds left in the magazine, so I get out 2.4 seconds. Uh, its reload threshold is 0 0.8 times or whatever. Uh, it's a really good gun, I really like it, uh, since they nerfed it, it's not as good, like before, when it first came out, it was really really good, and had some epic burst fire kills, like, the burst fire kills when it first came out were absolutely amazing, but now the burst fire has just gone downhill, and just doesn't work, so yeah, that's basically it. With the FN57 then, uh, I'm not going to give you the stats on that, or I'm not going to read them out, they'll probably be on the screen. But I, I left that stock because nobody really has any, or well, nobody really used any attachments. It was just a, a secondary that was pretty decent for uh, Call of Duty in that, you know, in that time in, in Black Ops 2. It was just a, a good secondary to have. Uh, but on the AN-94, we have the Coyote RDS and the UG rail, or the UGL rail. Um, I have the UGL rail because, you know, I don't know, I don't think anybody run it with a grip. I think some people did, but others um, run it with a grenade launcher, and that's why on the Assault class, I have the grenade launcher, I have the M320HE, uh, on the under uh, of my gun, like on the under barrel of my gun, which, um, to be fair, got, I got some pretty decent kills, which, you know, recorded my gameplay with, so yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, I also ran with a first aid pack, just because, well, you didn't get them in Black Ops 2, but you all need a bit of health now and then. And then I run with the M67 frag, because that's just a normal frag grenade from any Call of Duty. It's just, you know, the standard frag grenade. So yeah, guys, that's my uh, sort of class. If you want more info in the future, because I'm thinking about making this a series, then tell me in the comments. And guys, don't forget... Wednesdays, I'm bringing back the Builder Bot, so if you don't mind, comment either on the last Builder Bot I did, or on this video, what kind of robots you want to see on Wednesday. So, yeah, before I forget all of that, do please leave a like, subscribe, I'm Demanding Monkey, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Please enjoy the gameplay. So, yeah, guys, I've been Demanding Monkey, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya!